So the Lord God caused the man to fall into a deep sleep. And while he was sleeping, he took one of the man's ribs and then closed up the place with flesh. Then the Lord God made the woman from the rib he had taken out of the man, and he brought her to the man. The man said, This is now bone of my bones and flesh of my flesh. She shall be called woman, for she was taken out of man. That is why a man leaves his father and mother and is united to his wife, and they become one flesh. See love like this comes once in a lifetime For the first time I believe it to be true All of my The marriage vow is the verbal expression of a lifelong commitment that's God designed for us. The richest fulfillment, the promise of marriage is anchored in that concept. When we say in the vow, from this day forward, we mean lifetime. Habang buhay. Husbands ought to love their own wives as their own bodies. He who, who loves his wife loves himself. For no one ever hated his own flesh, but nourishes and cherishes it. Just as the Lord does the church. For we are members of his body, of his flesh, and of his bones. For this reason, a man shall leave his father and mother and be joined to his wife, and the two shall become one flesh. You are found sets me free Nicholas Richie, C.P. and Jonabel Di Operio are now possible. Forever I 